Hello my dear fourth grade students. Today I'm going to solve indefinite integral. So let's get to it. For integral of 3x squared plus x times e to the power of x dx, we are going to apply u times v minus integral of v times du. So first we have to define which part is u and which part is v prime. Okay. So the first part is u is equal to 3x squared plus x. When we differentiate both sides, du is equal to 6x plus 1 dx. And v prime is e to the power of x times dx. When we find v, we will get here just e to the power of x. Because derivative of e to the power of x is e to the power of x times dx. And after that, we will write u times v minus integral of v times du is equal to u is 3x squared plus x times v is e to the power of x minus integral of v is e to the power of x and du is 6x plus 1 times dx is equal to e to the power of x times 3x squared plus x minus integral of by using distributive property we will have here as 6 x times e to the power of x plus e to the power of x times 1 is itself and dx is equal to e to the power of x times 3x squared plus x minus integral of 6 x times dx dx e to the power of x dx and the minus integral of e to the power of x dx so to find it we write e to the power of x times 3x squared plus x minus let me take the coefficient out of integral 6 times integral of x times e to the power of x dx minus what is the integral of e to the power of x? e to the power of x plus c1 constant term is equal to e to the power of x times 3x squared plus x minus 6 times we will use here again u times v minus integral of v times du so let's start over again this part is a I will solve a is here so integral of x times e to the power of x dx is equal to for u is x and for v prime is we are going to use e to the power of x dx if u is x when we differentiate both sides we will have du is equal to dx for v prime we will get for v is just e to the power of x and after that u times v x times e to the power of x a minus integral of v times e to the power of x times du dx is equal to x times e to the power of x minus e to the power of x plus c2 constant term and after that for the general for the general let me take the general part here e to the power of x times 
3x squared plus x minus 6 times a, a is x times e to the power of x minus e to the power of x plus c2 minus e to the power of x plus c1 is equal to e to the power of x times 3x squared plus x minus 6 times x times e to the power of x is 6x e to the power of x plus 6 times e to the power of x minus 6c2 minus e to the power of x plus c1 e to the power of x is a common factor so is equal to e to the power of x times 3x squared plus x minus 6x plus 6 and minus 1 moreover minus 6 c2 plus c1 is equal to e to the power of x times 3x squared x minus 6x is minus 5x 6 minus 1 is plus 5 minus 6c2 plus c1 at s or another constant term plus c okay we found the answer and we are together with another special question here it says integral of the x over square root of 21 minus x squared minus 4x first I'm going to find here one perfect square how can we make it integral of dx over I will separate 21 like 25 minus 4 minus x square minus 4x and is equal to integral of dx over 25 minus 4 plus x square plus 4x inside of the square root is equal to integral of dx over square root of 25 minus 4 plus x square plus 4x is square of x plus 2 is equal to integral of dx over the common factor I'm going to use a 25 a 25 times 1 minus x plus 2 square over 25 is equal to integral of dx over at 25 minus 1 minus x plus 2 square and 25 is 5 square so it's going to be x plus 2 over 5 square inside of the root it is our radical part is equal to integral of dx over a 25 a minus 1 a minus so let's say a u is equal to x plus a 2 over 5 so it's going to be as a u square I'm sorry it's not minus it's uh, times okay and is equal to we can take 25 out of roots as 5 times square root of 1 minus a u square if u is equal to x plus 2 over 5 what is du u is from x plus 2 over 5 it's going to be x over 5 plus a 2 over 5 what is derivative of x over 5 plus 2 over 5? It is just 
1 over 5 dx. So is equal to dx over 5. du is equal to dx over 5. And from here, we will have 5 times du is equal to a dx. After that, we'll replace for dx is a 5 times du over a 5 times square root of 1 minus u squared cancels each other out. So integral of du over square root of 1 minus u squared. Let me simplify that. What is integral of du over square root of 1 minus u squared? It is arc sine u plus constancy. So, which happens to be arc sine, what is u? u was x plus 2 over 5 plus constancy. Or, it is a minus arc cosine u plus c, which means minus arc cosine u was x plus 2 over 5 plus constancy. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.